Hello everyone, welcome to Yellow Pages Nursing. Today's video is about drug calculation of IV injection amiodarone using an infusion pump and the responsibilities of nurse. Well, before entering into the session, if you have not subscribed to the channel, please subscribe to the channel. And do not forget to hit the bell icon to receive instant notifications. Let's get into the session. Injection amiodarone comes under the group Antiarrhythmic Agent and it is indicated in case of life-threatening ventricular arrhythmias like ventricular tachycardia and ventricular fibrillation. Injection amiodarone, otherwise called cardarone, comes in ampule form with one ampule containing 3 ml which equals 150 mg of strength. Now, let's discuss about the IV dosage for infusion in adults. Injection amiodarone is usually diluted in dextrose 5% water or normal saline. The infusion is given in two forms, either rapid infusion or slow and maintenance infusion. In case of rapid infusion, amiodarone is diluted either in 100 ml of DFA water or 15 to 20 ml of DFA water. And it is given as 150 mg loading dose which may be retreated as necessary. And this loading dose is given over 10 minutes at the rate of 15 mg per minute. Next is slow infusion and maintenance infusion. In this case, 900 mg that is 6 ampule or 18 ml of amiodarone is diluted in D5 water 500 ml which contains 1.8 mg per ml. For slow infusion, 360 mg is given over 6 hours at the rate of 1 mg per minute and for maintenance infusion, 540 mg is given over 18 hours at the rate of 0.5 mg per minute which altogether equals 900 mg of amiodarone. Now let's get into the example. Doctor's prescription for injection amiodarone infusion is concentration is 900 mg D5 water 500 ml, doses 1 mg per minute for first 6 hours, followed by 0.5 mg per minute for next 18 hours. Now, how do we prepare the infusion? All we need is an infusion pump, an IV set, and the dilution solution. Amiodarone can also be given through a syringe pump when a small amount of infusion is to be administered, that is 50 ml or less than that. As we previously discussed, the IV compatible solutions are dextrose 5% and normal saline. A very important thing to keep in mind is the presence of a very good IV access line before beginning the infusion. Now, the formula reads desired dose multiplied by quantity multiplied by time and minutes divided by available dose which gives the ml per hour. Doctor's prescription for injection amiodarone infusion, concentration is 900 mg with D5 water 500 ml, doses 1 mg per minute for first 6 hours and followed by 0.5 mg per minute for next 18 hours. Now, let's calculate this for a dose of 1 mg per minute for first 6 hours. The concentration is 900 mg with D5 water 500 ml. So as per the formula, the desired dose is 1, quantity is 500, time in minutes will be 60, and available dose is 900. Applying all into the formula, we get the answer 33.3 ml per hour. Hence, the dose 1 mg per minute is given as 33.3 ml per hour for 6 hours. Next will be the dose of 0.5 mg per minute for the next 18 hours. Here, the desired dose will be 0.5, quantity is 500, time in minutes will be 60, and available dose is 900. Applying all into the formula, we get the answer 16.6 ml per hour, which can be rounded up and gives the answer 17 ml per hour. Hence, the dose 0.5 mg per minute is given as 17 ml per hour for the next 18 hours. Now, the second example. Injection amiodarone infusion, concentration is 600 mg in 50 ml dose is 1 mg per minute for first 6 hours followed by 0.5 mg per minute for next 18 hours the first calculation is dose for 1 mg per minute for first 6 hours here the desired dose is 1 quantity is 50 time and minutes is 60 and available dose is 600 applying all into the formula we get the answer 5 ml per hour Hence, the dose 1 mg per minute is given as 5 ml per hour for 
the first 6 hours. Next calculation is dose for 0.5 mg per minute for the next 18 hours. Here the desired dose is 0.5, quantity is 50, time in minutes will be 60 and available dose is 600. Applying all into the formula we get the answer 2.5 ml per hour. Hence the dose 0.5 mg per minute is given as 2.5 ml per hour for the next 18 hours. Now let's discuss about the nursing responsibilities while administering injection amiodarone. Monitoring vital signs hourly during intravenous infusion. Monitor blood pressure carefully during infusion. Auscultate the chest periodically or when patient complains of respiratory symptoms. Check for diminished breath sounds. Check the IV site for IV complications like thrombophlebitis. So this is all about today's video regarding drug calculation of injection, amiodarone infusion using an infusion pump and the nursing responsibilities. If you find this video useful, please like it and please subscribe it and do not forget to hit the bell icon to receive instant notifications. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.